processing fibers into wool. Once the rear sheep have developed a thick coat of hair, it is shaved off for getting wool. Wool is obtained from the sheep by a long process which involves various steps that is number one shearing number two scoring number three sorting number four combing number five dyeing number six spinning let's study each step one by one Step 1 Shearing The process of removing hair from the body of a sheep along with a thin layer of skin is called shearing. It is done manually with a large razor or with the help of shearing machine. After the shearing, the sheep is immediately dipped into an antiseptic to prevent any skin infection. Usually, fleece is removed during summer season. When the weather is hot, this enables sheep to survive without their protective coat. Most of you might be thinking that shearing hurts sheep. However, it is not true. Shearing does not hurt the sheep. All of you might have seen your father shaving his beard. Does your father feel the pain? The answer is no. Similarly, sheep does not feel the pain during shearing. The reason behind this is the uppermost layer of skin is dead. After shearing, the hair of sheep grow again before the onset of winter and protect them from the cold weather. Now, let's learn about the Second step. In this step, scoring takes place. The process of washing the fleece of sheep to remove dust, dirt, sweat, grease, etc. is called scoring. The sheared skin with hair is Thoroughly washed by washing with soap solution and a lot of water in a tank. Nowadays, scoring is done by machine. The scored hair are then dried. In the third step, Sorting is done. Sorting means separate out. After scoring, the dried hair of different textures are separated. This process is called sorting. The small fluffy fibers called burrs are picked out and sent for reprocessing. Step 4 
combing. The fleece is combed to remove the burrs. B U R R S. Burrs means tiny knots. The fewer the burrs, the better is the wool. The process by which selected curly wool fibers are straightened by passing through rollers is called combing. In fifth step, dyeing takes place. The natural fleece of sheep is black, brown or white in color. Hence, fibers are then dyed in different colors. Now, let's discuss about the next step of processing that is spinning. The wool fibers are straightened and twisted into yarn. The longer fibers are made into wool for sweaters and the shorter fibers are spun and woven into fabric that is woolen clothes. The quality of wool is judged on the basis of thickness, length, shine, strength and fitness of the fiber. Let's summarize what we have studied so far. Silk and wool are obtained from animals. That is why these are called animal fibers. Wool is obtained from the hair of sheep, camel, goat and rabbit. Wool is suitable fiber for making winter clothes. The process of removing hair of the sheep is called shearing. Shearing can be done either manually or with the help of shearing machine. The sheared skin with hair is thoroughly washed in soap solution to remove grease, dust and dirt. This process is called scouring. After scouring, the hair are dried and sorted depending upon the texture of the wool. The selected curly wool fiber are then straightened by passing through rollers. Then the wool fibers are dyed and finally sent for spinning and weaving process.